Valentine's Day coming up, aka Treat Day. So we're gonna make some healthy vegan truffles with maca and raspberries and various kinds of chocolates. They're gonna be delicious. And today I am calling them truffles of love. Now for the simple version, you're just gonna melt some dark chocolate, but I've got some cocoa butter here for my friends at Navitas Naturals, and I've never worked with it before, so I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna take some cocoa butter, and they recommend putting it in a blender. If you're doing dark chocolate, then you wanna melt it in a double boiler or just on the stove if you're feeling adventurous. And because I'm using cocoa butter, I'm also going to have to add some cocoa powder and some coconut sugar. So all of this would be replaced by dark chocolate. I've just blended this up to get to the same texture and flavor of melted dark chocolate. Regular truffles use cream. Vegan truffles use coconut milk. The canned kind, not the drinking kind. You want the thickest coconut milk you can find. Now that's the basics. I'm gonna add some thawed out raspberries for some fun and also some cocoa nibs. You can use plain cocoa nibs. These ones are sweetened a little bit, so they're cocoa nibs with a little bit of chocolate around them. And um, these add a little bit of crunch and double the chocolate in your truffles. Last, but certainly not least, I'm gonna add another superfood, some maca powder. This is a superfood from Peru that is said to help balance hormones. So for those of you who get irritable when you eat chocolate, this is a great thing to add. And we blend. So you should wind up with a texture that looks somewhat like chocolate mousse. And I should have mentioned earlier, but the only reason I'm using a blender for this is because I have this twister jar that can scrape down the side as I go. Otherwise, I would definitely use a food processor for this. Now you can set that in the fridge to chill for a little while until it's ready to form. Now we've already got two kinds of chocolate with the chocolate and the truffles plus the nibs. If you wanna go for the triple chocolate threat, you can add one spoonful of cocoa powder, one spoonful of ground almond or ground coconut, and one spoonful of coconut sugar. Then as you form your truffles, you can just coat them in a dusting of cocoa powder. And you'll wanna keep these in an airtight container in the fridge because they do have coconut milk and raspberries in them, so you can't leave them out or they will go bad. Wow, that's so good. You guys have to try this. I'm gonna give you three variations. One simple with dark chocolate, two with cocoa butter like I use today, or a three, a whole foods version with a base of dates. So whichever way you try it, hope you like it. Leave me a thumbs up if you like this video and recipe. You can check out all the details at the link down below. I've also got a little Valentine's Day treat for you, so check it out. And be sure to subscribe to my channel. I post new recipes and videos every single week, vegan recipes, nutrition tips, and inspiration. So click subscribe and I will see you again soon. Happy Valentine's Day, guys. Bye.